This is Daniel Cook painting a giraffe. Hi, I'm Mr. Robert, and he's going to teach me some painting hieroglyphs. Hi, Daniel. This is Daniel Cook on a bike, in a plane, on a farm, playing games with many places and friendly faces. We'll have lots of fun with Daniel Cook. This is Daniel Cook looking at Robert's work. Okay, so before we uh, start the paint, I thought it would be neat to show you this book of mine called Safari. Oh, that's a neat picture. Ah, giraffes. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I wonder if there's any giraffes in this neighborhood. Okay, now I've got to be able to see the giraffe. Yeah. All right, one thing about them is they're really tall. I don't know if we can fit them all in. Now, are you going to take over? And maybe do the spots or? Yeah, I'll do the spots. Okay, do you know how to hold that with your thumb? Are you right-handed? Yeah. Okay, put your thumb through there. This is Daniel Cook painting spots. With your left, no, with your left hand. With your left hand, because you're gonna paint with your right hand. Okay. Okay, and don't tip it too much or you're gonna get it on your pants. Or even worse, you'll get it on my pants. <laughs> now keep checking out the giraffe. You have to keep looking. Can you see it from where you are? Yeah. The thing about doing art is you have to keep looking at what you're doing. OK, I can work down on this end. You can work up on the neck. OK. Hey, one of them sh shaped like a heart. I think we should do legs. Yeah. OK. Well, giraffe right? wouldn't be able to walk if you had no legs. That's right. Let's, do, let's get it on the tongue. What color's the tongue? Blue. Blue? Kind of a bluish purplish. Well, are you ready for some blue? Yeah. <laughs> They're kind of blue. Yeah. If you mix the blue with the brown, then it won't be so bright. Or you can make it straight blue. Yeah, I kind of need a dark. Do you want me to put some black with it? Or just try, try mixing actually, that with the brown, see what happens. Actually. Okay. Mix the blue with the brown, see what happens. Does that look sort of like the tongue color? Yeah, it, it does. Okay. It's kind of a purple. They have kind of a purple. This is Daniel Cook painting a tongue. Wow, they got a long tongue. <laughs> they usually, they have long ones too. Yeah. That's an amazing tongue. Wow, it looks kind of shiny. Yeah, looks a tiny bit like Bluebeard. Yeah. We'll call him that. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna give the painting from Sky. Okay. Maybe we can, maybe we can do a meeting, eating from some tree, eating from a tree. Well, in that case, <clears throat> he's eating from a tree. I wonder what color we'll use. Green. <laughs> now, doing a tree, it's kind of best to start at the bottom and go up. Yeah, that's what I figure. Now he can be eating a. You can make the tree smaller than him. He can be eating from a tree, the top of a tree that's smaller than him. They often do that. You're gonna make it taller than him, or just the same height? Just you could put same the height as you could put the green here if you want, and he could be licking the green part. <laughs> that's great. Now their tree, often their trees. Can I tell you something? Their trees often are, are flat top because they nibble the top of the tree, so you can make it quite wide and flat, even wider. Yeah, that's that's getting it. What a team. Yeah. Do you think we should sign it? That's a good idea. Okay, we'll both sign it. You write yours first. You write yours in blue and I'll write mine in brown. I want to write mine in red. You want to write yours in red? Of course you want yeah. to write yours in red. One of my favorite colors. What am colors. I thinking? Okay, put her up there and you say your name as you write it. This is Daniel Cook signing his name. D. D. A. Get more paint, get more paint. Yeah, there's more paint. Sure, <laughs> you don't want a smaller brush. N. Yeah, that's kind of hard. I. Right, go. Oh, yeah. More paint. 
Yuck. Mm. Oh, Daniel. Excellent. I'll write Robert. But I'll make mine in brownish blue. <laughs> What do you think the last letter would be? T. Right. That must be it. There. Thank you very much, Robert, for showing me how to paint today. It was very fun. Yeah, it was fun for me, too. You're more than welcome. <laughs>